Good morning, everybody. Thanks so much for joining our Monday morning uh, product focus session. Today, our incredibly knowledgeable technical educator, Jemima, will be talking about benefits of Jumo and how you can use it in your salons. So please find out how you can incorporate Jumo with about any brand you currently stock. Over to you, Jemima. Thank you, Lydia. Hello, everybody. I'm just going to share my screen and... Well, let's get started. Jumo is natural and preservative free skincare for the face and body for those of you that do not know much about it. We have got lots of information to follow so that you'll be able to see what is in store for you to use in your salon. So what is Jumo? Jumo, it's a retail and professional range of skincare. They're products that are both for the face and the body. Their real focus is on the skin microbiome and enhancing the ability of the skin to do what it does naturally and do it to its best performance. The Jumo products can be used on their own with nothing else, or they can also be incorporated into the treatments that you're doing within your salon with any product range. The idea behind Jumo is that the products can be used as their own cleanser, and over time, the skin will naturally improve the natural moisture of the skin. The Jumo products can be used, like I said, with any skin products that you're currently using. And the idea is to improve the biodiversity of the skin, which helps to improve the natural function. They were originally, and are still to this day, uh, made in the UK. They were formulated by some very clever people who have a physics and chemist background and were designed as a result of not being able to find what they were looking for for their own skins. So they made their own. So why should you be using Jumo? Well, by its design, it will encourage the biodiversity of the nutrients on the skin. This is key for good skin function, just like it's crucial for good health, um, for good gut health that we know much about with what's being talked about these days with a greater understanding of the gut microbiome. So the Jumo is like talking about the gut, but it's for the skin instead. So what is the biodiversity of the skin? It's a word that you'll be hearing a lot more about. And the biodiversity of the skin means to have varied types and large quantities of the varied types of organisms that live on and within our skin. This will allow the skin to perform its job of protection and to help build and keep strong immunity for our good health. The living organisms on the skin, as you may know, include bacteria, fungus and viruses. And all the Jumo products for the face and body are all encouraging the biodiversity of these organisms on the skin, which creates the skin to be really microbiome competent. With Jumo, they focus less on the individual ingredients and more about the effects of how all of these ingredients actually work together to have the effect that they do. So it's the synergy of the Jumo ingredients that are really important. Um, there isn't one particular product that's the hero ingredient that we know a lot of skincare products do talk about. Jumo is based with a background in a physics principle and the different ingredients, when they're all brought together, it's the harnessing of those qualities together that has the results to help the biodiversity on the skin. So if we were to pluck out one ingredient of any of um, the ingredients that are used, that alone would not be able to do what all of them together are able to achieve. So with the right combination of the ingredients that we're going to touch on shortly, they enhance, they improve, they strengthen, and they help to rebuild the skin's microbiome in a synergistic way. So let us introduce you to the full range of Jumo. You can see here, we have three smaller looking tubes, uh, a larger looking tube, and then we have the professional size range. So the smaller tubes are the three facial products. The slightly bigger one with the orange lid is the body product. And the large product at the end is the one that you can be using in your salon in a professional size. Now, we'd just like to show you something to do with how Jumo effectively can help the skin. I'd like you to take a look at this next slide and see what you think. This is Little Mason. Little Mason has had a very severe journey 
to healing skin. And we actually have an article that we will be able to share with you because this story was published overseas to showcase the effect that Jumo has had on Jumo's, um, I'm sorry, on Mason's little skin and its recovery. So you can see the before at the very beginning to where he is now. You can just see his eyes popping over in that bottom corner. But I wanted to show you that first up so that you can actually see how effective Jumo can be. Within the range, you actually have a couple of options. You have an original, what we call the original honey formula, which has honey as its base ingredient, along with many other important ingredients that you can see that are listed there, like cinnamon and sea salt and clove and a few others. On the other side, you'll see the vegan formula, which does not have any honey. It has the amla ingredient instead, but it has all the same other ingredients with the cinnamon, the sea salt, the clove, the orange, and so on. So when you're thinking about your clientele or your own personal needs or what you know that your clients may or may not like, you have a honey option and you also have a vegan option because the vegan is um, used with the amla ingredient in place of the honey. At the bottom of that page, you'll be able to see in the honey formula, we only have one facial cleanser. And in the vegan formula, we have two facial cleansers and a body cleanser as well. So I'm going to just share with you a little bit about the honey and the amla, and we'll come back to it towards the end. Because of there are lots of ingredients, we're going to touch on all of these so we can get to the information around how to use these products. You may be aware how important honey can be as a skin uh, ingredient in its ability to soften the skin. It'll really help moisturize and it's really effective in its healing process. So for skins that need a bit of healing and care, the honey will be able to do that. It's like wrapping it up in cotton wool. Also, it's very nourishing, it's healing, it has natural antioxidant properties, um, and it will also help to clean up any of the free radicals that need to be, to be swept up. And with the AMLA formula, uh, for those of you that do not know much about AMLA, it's a medicinal plant that's been reported to be a unique source of antioxidants, and it's really rich in ascorbic acid and polyphenols. It's been used for centuries in Ayurvedic medicine um, as a food, but also in its ingredients for food. It has a lot of uh, effective benefits for the skin, some of which you can see there, and its ability to really help clean up the free radicals and reduce damage to the skin, therefore will have a strong effect on its ability to reduce the effects of aging. We'll cover off a bit more towards the end of this presentation. We're also just going to go through a couple of the ingredients that we've got listed. You can see there are a few from that um, a slide a few before. There are a number of ingredients um, and we have some further documentation and uh, also some videos on this as well to help you go uh, and understand it. So with the sea salt, so it's a bit like having the beach in a bottle, but you've got it in your bathroom. So the sea salt's a really strong component to help the natural activity that the skin needs. It'll help to balance um, any greasy skin. It helps to reduce impurities. It helps to renew the complexion. So it's got that real effect with the skin being rich in minerals and trace elements as well. It's got a raw cane sugar component, which for those that have used this before in skincare will know it's a natural humectant and it will actually help draw the moisture from the environment into the skin. It's also a source of the glycolic acid, which will also help with the cell turnover of the skin. And the word it helps to renovate the skin um, by stimulating its uh, action. It will reduce the oiliness. It will balance out what the skin naturally needs. For some skins, I need a bit more, some I need a bit less and this will help to create balance in the skin. Uh, we've got the saponins. And for those of you that understand around the drying elements of some cleansers uh, that have got really soap and chemical based ingredients, this doesn't, the saponins do the job. They're a natural cleanser and they've got a really long list of skin benefits, but the saponins will not dry out the skin, which is what all our skin needs. So it's used often um, as an anti-irritant, antioxidant. You can see a few others there, anti-inflammatory, and it will really help with inflammation in the skin. So saponins will not dry out the skin. It'll actually help to balance what the skin needs without causing any damage. Then there's a few different, uh, we've got two varieties of cinnamon that are also used in the Jumo. And that's really essential for helping with problematic skin, any sort of acne, 
oil imbalances, but cinnamon is also a really strong antioxidant and they have two variations that they have chosen to use in, uh, to use within the Jumo formulas. And think about the antioxidant damage that so many people tend to have through lack of sleep, um, through eating badly, through um, you know not exercising, stress, that's another big one. So the antioxidant component of the cinnamon will be really strong in helping to keep the skin looking really well and to help reduce the aging. It's also got clove in it, which when you smell the formula, some people can pick out the clove smell straight away. Um, this has been used for centuries in traditional medicine, anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, antiviral. Um, it's also used as an insect repellent for some products as well. Um, it is great with stopping oxidative stress into the skin. Then we've got things like sweet orange oil. This has always been a, a strong user for skins that have an acne oil imbalance. So it can actually help to balance that out. It's also used to help um, improve the immunity of the body. Uh, and it's a great uh, benefit to help reduce any inflammation in the skin. We've got a component of orange juice, a small amount of orange juice in here. It's a good source of antioxidants. Uh, it may help to reduce the inflammation in the skin. It'll have a slight stimulating action and it will actually help to brighten the skin without doing too much of the overwork. Then there's a few ingredients with the guar gum and the gum arabica and they are fillers in the sense of helping to thicken up the product. They're both plant extracts so they're derived from the plants and they will actually help to bind the organic ingredients within the Jumo products. They also have some benefit in terms of its anti-inflammatory um, effect and soothing properties to the skin. So let's talk a bit more about the honey. Think of honey as an A plus if you were thinking about being in school. It is a natural antiseptic, antibacterial and anti-inflammatory and has been used for a very long time as a skin ingredient for these reasons. It'll help to reduce inflammation in the skin. It helps to fight infections. It will actually help also to be a natural humectant and keep the skin moisturized from within. Honey has natural healing properties. It's really beneficial for things like eczema and psoriasis, any damage to the skin that needs healing. Honey will also help the natural desquamation process that our skin does. Uh, it, has, it also has the moisturising and nourishing properties naturally. It's anti-aging and it will help to build the collagen, high in antioxidants and that brightening effect also. Also, if you think about summer times and when skin has been a little bit overworked in the sun, uh, great to be using as a body wash or a face wash to help soothe and calm any sort of redness or sunburn. And some of the benefits of the Amler ingredient. Um, it's really gentle on the skin. It's deeply cleaning. It's really effective at neutralizing free radicals. It's really rich in vitamin C and also vitamin A. And we know that the vitamin C is really effective at toning and brightening the skin. And vitamin C will help maintain that real youthfulness to the skin that we need. Um, it'll brighten the complexion and it will actually help to also fade and reduce the signs of pigmentation on the skin. Vitamin C is a powerful antioxidant and helps to protect the skin from the, from the damaging effects of the sun and the age and pollution and lack of sleep and running families. <laughs> uh, vitamin A in the amla, it's really essential for that balanced oil production within the skin. And the amla will also help to regulate collagen um, and to prevent, the, to prevent any damage to the skin and help to heal the scarring. So it really protects the skin's collagen and elastin as well. So great benefits that you can see there uh, for the amla. So how do I know which one I would choose? Because you've got a few to choose from. So the original honey formula, it's identifiable with its yellow lid. And truly, it's ideal for anyone and everyone. Anyone can use this. It's for all age groups. It's ideal for the whole family to be using if you wanted to have one product sitting within a shower. Um, it's for all skin types, all skin ages. It's ideal for a range, a really strong range of skin conditions and skin types. So for acne skins, combination skins, red, flaky, irritated, damaged. Um, think of those skins that you know have an impaired skin barrier. This will be a great addition to their routine. 
The honey formula will help to reduce the breakouts. It's really effective to use on skins that you know take a long time to heal and may be mineral and vitamin deficient. So perfect for any skin type. And if you've got young children that are wanting to start a skin routine but don't want anything too strong or too active, I promise you this Jumo skincare will be the easiest way to get them into a really good routine that will actually encourage the skin microbiome to be at its best. The next one you could choose from is the Young Skin Wash with the Amla ingredient. It's ideal for children up to the early 20s is where it's sort of positioned. It's really gentle on the skin. The amount of amla extract that's used in this product is optimised for a young skin, so it's not going to be too active. It'll help to reduce the breakouts and it will help to cleanse the skin of dirt and grime. It'll assist with the collagen production and it will help to heal any scarring. So perfect for the skins that are going through that real teenage years of activity and to help the scarring as it starts to appear. It's also a really gentle exfoliator and it helps to prevent the buildup of dead skin it's great for those that don't like the smell of honey. So if you've got clients that may not like honey, the feel or the smell, this is a really great selection for you to use. But think about this. You've got the yellow lid with the honey formula and you've got the amla with the aqua lid. You can use any of those on any skin that you're seeing in an age group up to 20, 21, 22 years of age. But the skins that are over that sort of time or that age group, it can be say 25-ish, we've got something else for you. And this is the Jumo face wash with the Amla and it's designed for what we would call an adult skin or a skin over the age of 25. The amount of Amla that's used within this product is optimised for the skins 25 years and over. It has a higher concentration of the Amla than the young skin formula that we were just talking about. Out of the whole range, this product here is the most active formula and it's really great for those that have got concerns with preventing ageing or showing some signs of ageing or have a lot of signs of ageing. This is the great fit for, this, for those sorts of skins. If you've got a skin that's really dull and lifeless, smoker's skin, messy skins, um, rosaceous skins, any sort of red skins as well in the 25 and plus age group, uh, or have pigmentation concerns, or they've got skin barrier concerns, they've been overworking their skin and it needs the healing and repairing, this will be your go-to. This is the adult skin with the Amla. And then we've got the body wash with the Amla, and this is identifiable with its orange lid, and it can be used by everybody as well. It's the perfect one to have in the shower for the whole body to use on their skin, and they can replace, if they're using soapy um, cleansers, <clears throat> excuse me, or soaps, even a cake of soap, this can be the perfect replacement for that, and it will not dry out, <clears throat> excuse me, it will not dry out the skin. Think back to what we were talking about with the ingredients with the saponins in there. That will cleanse the skin naturally, but it will not dry out the skin at all. In fact, it will help increase the biodiversity of what the skin needs to function really well. You can use the body wash directly onto the skin and wash up. It won't foam up or soap up like soap does, but you'll be able to see it spreading onto the skin. You can use it directly onto the skin or pop it onto a loofah or onto a washcloth and gently clean the skin. This too will encourage the biodiversity that the skin needs. This is also a great product along with the face um, products for keeping in a sports bag or if the kids are going swimming, the chlorine after being in the swimming pool can be really damaging to the skin microbiome and this is a perfect fit to help repair the skin after being in the swimming pool. We also have the professional size Jumo, which is new to Australia. Uh, it's a 500 ml bottle. It's not for retail sale. It's for use in the salons and spas. It'll sit beautifully amongst your professional range in the treatment room. And it can be used on the face, the body, the bust. It's great for manicures and pedicures. And it's also a great cleanser before people are using their LED machines or any other machinery. So if you have clients coming in um, and setting up to be able to use the LED machine on their own but need to clean their skin first, this will be a great one to use. 
And then we've got how do you use the Jumo in the salon, no matter what skincare range you are using. We really believe that the skin microbiome um, and the skin barrier that we know a lot about, but the skin microbiome friendly products are the way of the future. And this is a new way that you could actually add an additional step into your already facial routine. You might do it as an extra cleansing step. You might use it as a skin microbiome mask. You could mix a bit of Jumo with your massage medium or mix a little bit with a moisturizer. You could use it as its own new cleanser. You might replace your cleanser that you're currently using. Um, and you can do that by mixing a little bit. You'd remove the makeup first. Then you would mix about a pea size amount of the Jumo onto your fingertips, mix it with water, massage into the skin, and then you'd either rinse it off with water by splashing it onto your face or using a gentle face cloth. You can use it as a mask and it's great to do it this way. So after your makeup's removed and the skin's been cleaned really well, you could mix a teaspoon of Jumo um, with a teaspoon of water and you can mix it well into a little bowl with your, with your uh, mask brush and paint it onto the skin and leave it on there for five minutes. That's all you've got. If you've got a bit longer, you could leave it on for longer and then you would warm towel it off like you would normally with, a, with a, any sort of face mask. It can also be used with lasers and IPL. So it can be used before the treatments to clean the skin and prepare the skin microbiome for about what's about to happen. Um, it can be used before needling as a cleanser and also as a pre and post treatment um, as a cleanser after microdermabrasion and peels. So no matter what skincare range that you're using, comfortably know that you can add the Jumo cleanser in because the cleanser has a few different ways that it can be used as the cleanser, as a mask. Um, that's, that's a great way to be able to use it within the salons. So we've also been performing a skin health treatment. And the way that we are doing that is we are removing this, the makeup on the face first, and then we are cleansing. And you could use whatever cleansers that you use within your salon. And if you were then follow on with a lotion or a conditioner afterwards, you would do those steps naturally. And then in your glass bowl, um, you could do it as a treatment. You'd mix half a tablespoon of Jumo and you could use any of the formulas that we've just gone through. So the honey formula or the Amla formula, which is vegan. And you could mix that with half a tablespoon of water and you put it into a little bowl and you can whisk it up in your little bowl like you're um, whisking a little bit of ingredients to make your cake with, whisk it well, and then apply that, paint it on with the brush over the whole face, neck and decolletage area. And you could leave that on for a good 10 minutes. While that's on, you might perform a scalp massage, you might do a hand massage or a little go down and wash the feet with the Jumo and give the feet a massage. Once you've left that on for the time frame that you have available to you, you could actually remove that with a warm towel or your fibrilla. Well, the other option would be to leave that Jumo mask on and perform your facial massage with your massage medium on top of that. Now, ideally, it would be with uh, the Synchro Nourishing Cream, which is very healing and regenerating from the genetic range that we use. So you'd perform the massage over the top of the Jumo mask if you've chosen to leave that on. Once you finish that, massage. Uh, you could then apply another mask on top from your professional skincare range and it could be another cream mask, it could be a collagen sheet mask, it could be a professional mask that you mix up um, and apply to the skin. Put the mask as usual on top of that, leave that on for as long as you normally would and then when you have taken that off, removed it with a warm towel or your fibrilla or however you do that. You could then just apply your nourishing cream, your protection cream or your sunscreen that you would normally complete your facial treatment with. If you want to add a little bit of extra, you could add a dot size amount of the Jumo to your nourishing cream, your protection cream or your sunscreen. And by doing that, those steps, you will have performed a skin health treatment that will really encourage the healthy skin microbiome. And for the clients, how do they use it at home? There's a few different options that you can also teach them. So you can use it as it's designed to be used, which is as a cleanser. And it's used daily after makeup is removed. They would at home squeeze a pea-sized amount onto the fingertips, mix it with some water, massage it all over the face and neck. 
and then rinse it off. You could also encourage them to do a skin health treatment at home or leave it on as a mask and they could apply the cleanser to their face but instead of washing it off straight away they could actually leave it on their skin for a few minutes. So if they're in the shower and using their Jumo in the shower which is the perfect place to use it they could actually put the Jumo on their face to wash their skin first at the beginning of their shower and leave it on like they were leaving on a conditioner or a hair treatment. Leave it on until towards the end of the shower and then wash it off. The other thing that Jumo can be used for is as a spot treatment. So if there's pimples or spots coming up, you can actually apply like a dot size to wherever the pimples might be. Apply a dot size to those spots and leave it on as an overnight treatment. The last way that you can also use Jumo would be to mix just a little amount, half a pea size with your favourite cleanser, sorry, with your favourite moisturiser, I should say. Mix half a pea size with your favourite moisturiser or nourishing cream. And if it's a bit of a hit and miss, you might need to try a little bit less to start with and make sure that amount's right, depending on what cream or moisturiser is that you're using. So you can see there for the clients, they actually have an option to use that one product in a number of different ways at home. And we'd suggest that you try it out yourself as well so you know exactly what it does look like and feel like on yourself um, and also in your treatments. And if you have kids at home that are able to use the, uh, the Jumo as a trial for you, it'd be a good, good way to see how it works. So here is the full range again. The purple lid is for the adult skins and it has the amla as the main ingredient. Next one is the honey formula, which is the original formula with the yellow lid. And then we have the aqua lid, which is for young skins with the amla. The body wash for the whole family also has the amla ingredient. And with the um, professional size product, which I didn't cover off before, my apologies, the professional size uh, Jumo is the original honey formula. So think of the yellow lid in the retail, that's what the professional size one will do. And if you want to know a bit more about Jumo, here are some of Jumo's um, information about their origins. So we did a Vital Plus, we did a Future Beauty talk back in March where um, Linda and Nick, the formulators and makers of the product, did an interview with each other and they were talking about the facts and fallacies of Jumo. And also here is their website. And that's it. Thank you. Thank you so much, Jemima. That was very informative. Actually, when I think about Juma, I love the analogy that you said that it's like a bitch in the bottle. So when I think about it, it's actually like a bitch in the bottle. And I'm sitting on a beach under the umbrella. And with Juma, it's like sipping an antioxidant smoothie. So, right? <laughs> So yes, we all love Jumo and we and we say in the office is like everybody needs a bit of Jumo in their lives. So it's, it's, it's a beautiful product. And for those of you who have never tried Jumo, we have a very generous offer. I'm just going to share my screen with you just to show you. So you will have a chance to try Jumo if you haven't tried it before. We can give you uh, a choice of um, one or the other. So one is the honey version and the one is the vegan version. So it's just one Jumo for you to try if you've never tried it before. So, um, and only first 10 uh, of those of you who are interested can um, get it for free. We only ask you to pay $9 uh, postage fee. And if you are interested in the product, uh, so please call us. Um, to the office number on 1300-437-638 or email info at vicoplus.com.au. So we're going to send you the recording and we will send you a pricing information as well and Jemima's presentation. So thank you so much. Thanks, Jemima. And thank you so much for joining everyone. Have Thanks. a great day. Bye. Bye-bye.